everybody, Tina here from Tina's Coupon Swap and Reviews. Today I am bringing you another review from Yes Buy, and this is their the first time I put together their square cupcake four tier holder. This time I'm going to put together their ice cream cone stand for cupcakes, like you know the. You put the cupcake mixture in the cone and then you bake it and then this is the, the display for that so let's put this together so it comes all nicely wrapped and it comes padded in um, you know like bubble wrap and then it also comes in you know like plastic wrap so you have to take it all off this one this round piece did come with one but I struggled with the one from the cupcake holder as well, so I already took it off. So you didn't have to watch me struggle. So and I'm going to assume that it came with three and that one is extra so just in case and then again it comes with the little screwdriver um, to put it together so you don't have to worry about finding one so let's see this is going to be the top and you're gonna want the the um there's a beveled side and then there's a flat side so on the bottom piece you're going to want the beveled piece on the bottom so that you can stick the screw up into it and then it sits flat so but first thing you want to do is you want to take the little uh, rubber bottoms and stick them on you know like kind of like three six nine and twelve on a clock so let's do that first so okay, so I got all four of them on. Oh, let's see, yeah. And then, so then I'm going to put the screw through the bottom. And then I'm going to kind of hold it a little bit. And I'm going to screw one of these ends Okay, and I want to stick the beveled side up, and you're going to take another screw and you're going to screw it into the top. Alright, and it's nice and sturdy. So then, just to kind of show you, they'll kind of sit in there like that. So I'm going to get to making my cupcakes and I will be right back with you.
All right, who thinks this is gonna work? <laughs> I'm not sure how to uh, put these in my oven. So I used the rack and I used tin foil to kind of keep them up. Do you think that's going to work? Leave it in the comments below. We'll see in about 10 or 15 minutes. All right, let's check these out for the first time. Oh, epic fail. Let's get a, um, hold on. I gotta get a, I gotta get a pan under those. Hold on. All right, let's check it now. Yeah, so how many out there were screaming at me through the, through the computer? Put a pan underneath there. Put a pan underneath there. Yeah, you see that? It's still kind of liquidy. This was an epic fail, unless those ones end up turning out good, but I don't know what to do about that. I decided I would let it burn on the stove and then try to lift it up once it's cooled. I don't know if that's right. I don't know if I should do that, but that's what I'm doing. All right, last try. Let's Hopefully these are good because that smells really, really, really bad. They're really bad in here. It smells really bad. But they don't... I think they still need like five minutes. Oh my god, that is awful. so here you go I don't think they turned out too bad I did lose three but I mean there's only four of us here right now so that's like that's like one for everybody and three for me yeah okay so you can get this on Amazon you could type in yes buy um, ice cream cone stand this will come up um, I will put the link and the price which is $16.50 in the description box below oh if you think I did a pretty good job give me a thumbs up this I thought it was gonna be an epic fail but they're delicious I've already tested one of the ones that um, was a fail and I think I didn't do too bad so you guys have a wonderful night and I will see you on my next review. Bye!